subject to change. Some of the scientific studies have been changed based on now observations and research. Getting updated is really a challenge for students. Not only students, many people still believe the wrong or incomplete concepts that they have learned at school, especially the middle school level, are actually correct. If you have a reading habit, watch science videos like ours, or took science for higher studies, you might have known about some of these changes. So, today I will be debunking some information in textbooks that are thought to be correct, but are wrong or incomplete. We have five senses. How many senses do you have? If you ask this question to a middle school student, the answer will be five. They are sight, hearing, smell, taste, and touch. But is this the correct answer? Thousands of years before, Aristotle mentioned these senses in his book, De Anima. Later, neuroscientists found out almost 21 senses. Equilibrioception is one of them. This helps to sense movement and the balance of our body. As the head moves, fluid moves throughout the canals of the vestibular system in our inner ears. When the fluid moves, the small hairs within it move and they send messages to the brain through the nerves. Another one is thermoception, which allows us to feel the increase or decrease in temperature. Like them, there is a long list of senses. In smaller classes, children won't be able to understand all of these, but it should at least be mentioned that there are more than five senses. The taste buds are located in our tongue, according to the tongue map. The tongue map shows that sourness, bitterness, saltiness, sweetness, and umami are located in discrete regions of the tongue. We can taste umami in foods such as fish, meat, mushrooms, soup, soy sauce, etc. A German study in 1901 was misinterpreted which came out as a tongue map in 1942. But in 1974, this was revisited and found wrong. There are thousands of taste receptors in our tongue. Some taste buds are more receptive to certain tastes than others. They are distributed all over the tongue. They are not located in particular regions of the tongue as shown in the map. But we can still find the tongue map in our textbooks. Even after 45 years, it was found wrong. There are three states of matter. Solid, liquid, and gas. But where is plasma? The most common state of matter in the universe. Plasma exists in stars, including the sun, neon lights, fluorescent lights, plasma televisions, etc. Plasma is the fourth state of matter, which is formed by the ionization of gas. As we already know, when the applied energy increases, Solid changes to liquid, and liquid changes to gas. Just like that, when high energy is applied to a gas, either by heating or passing electric current, the electrons in their atoms will be stripped away and become free electrons. For example, the high temperature in the sun makes the electrons of its hydrogen and helium molecules free. These free electrons and positively charged nuclei form the plasma. There are man-made states of matter, like Bose-Einstein condensate. Middle school students may not be able to deeply understand these, but it should be mentioned that there exists the fourth state of matter, plasma. So, today I have discussed about some wrong and incomplete information that we have learned at school. This is not the end. I will be including more misconceptions in the next video. So, see you next week with the second part.